What is up, everybody? Today, we're starting a new series that is going to be every other week. It's a short video on a new piece of gear. This week, we're talking about a RGB LED, a small rig light. It could be a new piece of gear, it could be a piece of gear a company sent me, or it could just be something I've owned for a long time that is extremely useful and reliable. So stay tuned for this new series. Episode one, today we're talking about the small rig RM120. This light is an RGB or bicolor or both, whatever you wanna call it, light with 10-ish different functions or settings you can utilize, which is pretty awesome for only a $60 light. And keep tuned on Amazon and everything. Uh, you may find it cheaper or on sale, maybe for Black Friday. I'll leave a link in the description down below if you wanna check out this light, uh, but let's just talk about it. This light in the packaging comes with a little hot shoe adapter, which is pretty awesome, and the charging cable, which is just USB-C, which is very useful. Uh, however, it also comes with a little flexible rubber diffuser, and it also could be used for a protective case uh, even though this is made out of complete metal for the body, obviously. Uh, it has 120 individual LED lights in it that are RGB, which can also be used as a bicolor light. And it has a ton of different settings. I mean, we've got SOS, pulsing flame, welding police car, paparazzi, faulty bulb, and much, much more. So you have a ton of options to pick from when you're using this light. My favorite thing to use this light for though is its RGB settings. You can choose from literally any color. Uh, it gives you the option to choose from your RGB and white to create literally almost any color you could possibly wanna create. And I utilize this for product videos and thumbnails to match colors or use certain colors to match the product. Uh, and I find this very useful. But before we get into the goodies of the lighting of it, uh, it is made of fully metal for heat dissipation and durability. It has a three hour battery life in full power, full power, which is, that's a long time for this. This is thin. This is like as, as thin as your phone almost. This is almost the size of a phone. It is a very bright light at 1580 lux which if you are a lighting person, you'll know what that means. If you are not and you don't know what that means, it's it's brightness. Just take my word for it. It's, it's a pretty bright light for how small it is. Um, the advertising says you can get up to 36,000 colors, which is what I was saying earlier. You can have a plethora of options there. Um, and then you can also use it as a bicolor light. You can change the Kelvin temperature. So when you turn it on, you have whatever setting it turns on at. Uh, mine is currently in different bicolor settings. I can change the Kelvin. I can change it to a brighter light or a more warm light, you know? Boom, nice little, nice little backlight there. Uh, or you can change the mode. It has plenty of different modes to change colors or settings or what have you. I mean, here I can change the RGB settings to change it to a more, let's just say white or purple, or I can go to a full bluish looking light here or teal, whatever you want to call it. And this could also be used for the same purpose, a little, little key, a little backlight on the back back here. So there's plenty of different opportunities for this light, especially with this adjustable brightness knob that is super easy to use and not to mention how good it looks when it's inside the diffusing case. So that's really the gist of this, this RGB goodness of a tiny LED light, something to throw in your arsenal for everyday use, whether it be a wedding, commercial work, product videos, or what have you. So I'd recommend taking a peek at it for only $60. I mean, you can't really go wrong. It's a great gift to get your filmmaking or photography photographer friend because it could be used in almost any scenario. But that's it for today's video on this goodness of a piece of gear. And I'll see you on the next one.